This morning, students at another Orange County school are having to switch to virtual learning. The district confirming four positive tests at Avalon Elementary, but not everyone at the school will have to learn from home. Ezzy Castro is live outside the school for us this morning, and Ezzy, the switch to online learning only affects students in certain grade levels. Yeah, Justin, students in kindergarten, second and fourth grade will now have to stay home for the next two weeks and pivot to launch ed. And we also learned that over 30 people are now under quarantine and the school district released a statement last night, which reads in part all individuals and parents of children who are under quarantine orders have been notified. Please know that information related to any individual's medical history is confidential and protected by law. During this time, the entire campus will be thoroughly cleaned and disinfected. Now, the statement also says those students at home will not be participating in any school events or activities. And this comes just after two other Orange County public schools had to temporarily shut down because of cases of the virus. Olympia High School being first in the beginning of September after 13 positive cases. Health officials said many of those people who contracted the virus attended a birthday party. Then West Orange High School closed on September 21st and was initially going to open two weeks later, but the health department gave the all clear to open a few days earlier instead since quarantines ended on the 30th. Now back out here live, all the other grades here at Avalon Elementary will be able to continue face-to-face -face learning. As for the students who were sent home yesterday, they'll be able to come back to campus on Monday, October 26th. For now, live in Avalon Park, Ezzy Castro getting results news 6.